Hi, everybody. Brad Nessler here, and with me as always, Kirk Herbstreit and Lee Corso. And it's going to be a cold afternoon for this game between the Saints and the Vikings. Hold on to your hats, folks, because we've got some early season Conference USA action lined up for you. And here come the Vikings. Kirk, how do you see this one? This really looks like a deadlock. This could go to either team. The away team comes into this game with great confidence, and that's because of the play of their defense. Having one of the best corners in the game has allowed them to be more aggressive. That leads to turnovers, and that'll be why they win today. I really believe that these guys are going to do it. Now, that looks good on you, Lee. Anyway, let's send it down to the field. We'll see how these two teams play in this game as they prepare for the opening kickoff. Short kick. He didn't get a hold of that one. Number nine takes it at the 12. At the 40. Across midfield. At the 40. At the 30. To the 20. To the 10. Goodbye. And they're going to bring this one all the way back. Touchdown. And it looks like there's an injury down there on the field. He's holding on to his leg there, guys. I sure hope he's okay. And he hits the PAT. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Kicks it off. Bowman fields it at the one. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. They'll go to work at the 23-yard line. They'll take over at the 23-yard line. First and 10. He juked him out of his shoes. There's a stiff arm. McFadden brings him down. The halfback picks up a yard. One yard gain on the play. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on their own 24. They're lining up in the 5-2. They go with the option. Now he pitches it. McAfee with a takedown. That'll be a gain of three yards. Three-yard gain on the play. Third and six. Ball on the 27. 27-yard line. Back to pass. Rose has his fullback. McAfee brings him down. With the reception, gain of 12 on the play. It's first and 10. Ball on the 39. yard line. They'll line up in the wishbone. Inside handoff. Jake's off a tackle. At the 40. Big opening to the 20. To the 10. He's all the way home. Touchdown. The halfback got the call and was able to carry it to Pater. Yeah, looking smooth out there. He's one of those guys they can count on for big plays. And he misses the extra point. And here's the Pontiac drive summary.
Number nine already has one kick return that went for a touchdown. Let's see if they kick it to him again. Kicks it off. Martin fields it at the 22. Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. Today we get to watch a spectacular athlete at running back. When he's on the field, as he is right now, defenses really have to tailor their game plan for him. He's a heck of a player, and I really believe that he could have a huge game today. That makes two of us thin. I just don't know if there's enough talent on this defense, especially at linebacker, to compete with such a great running back. Well, I guess we'll just have to wait and see. Second and 11 coming up. Ball on their own 30. 30-yard line. Two tight end set. And they bring him down for a sack on the play. Good pressure there, guys. Yep, good pressure and a good blitz by the safety. He comes in literally uncontested. I thought he showed really good athletic ability there getting into the quarterback. Nice play. Third and long. Ball on their own 23. They come out with four wide out. Looking, steps up in the pocket. Short toss. That brings up a punting situation. I'll tell you what, this defense did a heck of a job that time to hold them to three and out. They line up to punt this one away. Lobdell punts it, and it's a good one. Bowman signals for a fair catch. That last drive resulted in a touchdown. They did a great job moving the ball on the ground. Let's see what they can do here. They'll start this drive at the 26-yard line. The Saints take over at the 26-yard line. First and they line up in a double tight set. And they got him for a loss. A loss on that one as he couldn't get past those big linemen. You got that right. They sacrificed their bodies in there and stuffed him. Second and 10. Ball on their own 26. Two tight end set. Davis gets a call. And they hit him in the backfield. Now that's what I'd love to see. A linebacker plays downhill against a run. That guy knows exactly what the heck is going on out there. Third and 15 coming up. Ball on the 21-yard line. Nickel defense. Drops back to pass. Looks. He steps up under pressure. And they got him. Under relentless pressure, the quarterback goes down for the sack. Those guys on defense are just pinning their ears back right now and coming in as fast as they can. Well, in that case, the offense needs to sneak in a screen pass at a halfback. Let him get behind the rest and then take off behind his blockers for six. No surprise here as they prepare to punt it away. Number 43 punts it, and he didn't kick that ball well at all. Number 26 calls for the fair catch. And now we'll see the offense come out onto the field for their next possession. And they'll look to capitalize on the good field position here. Hanson with four wide receivers. They'll throw on first down. He's looking. Batted ball. Incomplete. That's just good defense right there, Coach. It was, Kirk, but you know what? It's all reaction. Anytime you're out there on defense and the pass is within arm's length away, you knock it down. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball right around midfield. They line up in an eye. They go with a toss. Singleton with a takedown and a huge run by the tailback. This guy's always had outstanding vision, but it seems he's got some incredible quickness as well once he gets into the open field. Boy, you're right. This kid showed me he's a great-looking athlete. First and 10. Ball on the 28-yard line. Hanson 
Gives it up the middle. He jukes. And they make the stop. Couple of yards there by the tailback on the counter. Gain of two on the play. It's second down and eight to go. Ball on the 26. One man backfield. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. A gain of one. The ball carrier. One yard gain on the play. Third and seven coming up here. And this is the fifth play of the current drive. This is the kind of running back who can make you pay when he's in the zone. Setting up the play action. Wants to throw outside. It's deflected. The pass was knocked down. This defense is very aggressive, and they swarm to the football. They're always making plays to disrupt the passing game. Fourth and seven. Ball on the 25-yard line. They're going to try a long field goal here. It's up. And he didn't get all of it. It falls short. They'll get the ball here at the 25-yard line. First and 10. Straight ahead with the fullback. Thomas brings him down. They get five yards on the play. Five-yard gain on the play. Second and five coming up here. Ball on the 30. On the ground with the tailback. And now he's got room to run. Brought down. That was a pretty good run. Incredible effort there, running. It's first and 10. Ball on the 44. The defense sets up with five defensive linemen. Back to pass. He passes it, and it's caught, and down he goes. Couldn't get anything out of that. No gain on the play. So it's second and 10. Ball on their own 44. Drops back to pass. Looking. Throws off balance. Almost intercepted. Poor decision to throw it into such tight coverage. Third and ten. This is the fifth play of this drive. Nickel defense. He drops back. Looks. He's rolling left. Wants to throw outside. He's got it. Harvey with a takedown. Good job of attacking the coverage to keep the drive alive. That was a great looking pass to move the sticks on third down. It's first and ten. Ball on the 40 yard line. Davis gets the carry. They'll drop him for a loss. They gave the fullback a shot at picking up yardage, but he couldn't get anything. That was a beautiful thing to see that defense crash in and bust up the play. And that'll be the end of the first quarter with our score. The Vikings, seven. The Saints, six. Second and ten. Ball on the 40. Penalty markers down. They took too much time. Dead ball. Delay of game. On the offense. Five-yard penalty. Still. Well, that penalty down. drives them back, and they're shooting themselves in the foot here. Well, if they could just keep their concentration, they'll avoid situations like that. 
Second down, and they got 15 for the first down. Ball on the 45. Up the middle. And he's tackled. The fullback gains about four yards there. Gain of four on the play. It's third down and 11 to go. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Blocking this D tackle when he's in the zone, he's in, won't be easy. Lateral's back. He's got an opening. A little juke. The 10. And he's brought down. That was a huge lift. Brad, you're right. A run like that can really get the momentum rolling. And he hits the PAT. Time to take a look at the drive summary. It's brought to you by Pontiac. Fuel for the soul. Number nine is deep to receive. And look out, folks. He's looking to run another one back for six. Decent kick. Looks to be returnable. Number nine. Fields it at the nine. What should we expect to see out of this offense now? Uh, the last time they had the football, they had a great drive, but they just missed the field goal. I want to see if the defense has fixed the holes so they won't allow another big drive right here. They'll take over at the 26. Cautious to the left side. He's gobbled up in the backfield. Excellent play by the defense that time as they swallowed him up before he got back to the line. It's more like they devoured him. He had no shot of breaking clean. Second and 11. Ball on the 25. They'll line up in the power eye. And straight ahead we go with the fullback. Mobley tackles him for a loss on the play. Loss of a yard. Third and 12 coming up on this one. Ball on the 24. The defense lines up with six DBs. Back to pass. He tosses it short. Almost picked off. Good defense there, guys. I wonder if the quarterback is expecting to see man coverage there because he threw it right to the defense. And that's what's so tough about playing against the zone. You think a guy's open, and out of nowhere, a defender shows up. Just like that. Fourth and 12. Ball on the Looks like they're going to punt it away here. It's off, and it is a dandy. He dropped it. He just couldn't pull that one in clean. It's a full house backfield. Drops back to pass. He's looking. Across the middle. Got it to him on the run. Brought down. I like the defense that was called. They just didn't make the play on the ball. You're right. It wasn't necessarily bad defense. The offense just executed, and the result is a first down. First and 10. Ball on the 38-yard line. They'll line up in the wishbone. They'll give it off here. And down he goes. They get through. It's a full house backfield. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. He's got an opening. Tackle. And that was an excellent run there. Yeah, Brad, but it was also great blocking up front by the offensive line to open up the hole. First and 10. This is the fifth play of this drive. They'll line up in the wishbone. He drops back. Looking. Comes across the middle. Someone got a hand on it. And he's in the end zone. Touchdown. Spectacular play by the halfback. You've got to love this guy. He wants the ball every play. He runs it. He catches it. I wouldn't be surprised to see him throw it real soon.
Hunt. And he missed it. He oh, missed the extra it. point. Here's the drive summary brought to you by Pontiac. Number nine is back ready to receive, and boy, has he been the game breaker on special teams today. Kicks it off. McCaffey fields it at the three. He jukes him. Not a very good series for this offense on their last drive as they were forced into a three and out. Boy, oh boy, they had nothing going last time. Yeah, maybe, Scooter, you need to get out there and show them what you're made out of. Somebody get me a helmet quickly. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. From a defensive coordinator's standpoint, it can really help out your scheme when you get excellent run support by the corner. Not only does this kid tell him not to throw to his side, he's telling him not to run to his side. Yo. It's second down and 11 to go. Ball on the 28. Nickel defense. Back to pass. Steps up. Looks. With the throw. Complete. Has some daylight. That pass play goes nowhere. One yard gain on the play. Third and ten. Ball on their own 29. They come out with a big set. Hanson sets to go to the air. He's going right. The 50. And he's got him on the fly. That's how you convert third down, sweetheart. That was a good-looking play, wasn't it, Coach? Oh, yeah. This offensive coordinator must have seen something in the defense he really liked. It's first and ten. Ball right around midfield. This impact tailback would love nothing more than to have the ball in his hands right now. On the ground with the tailback. And they make the stop. Eight yards on the counter there. And this is the fifth play of the current drive. Hanson lines up in the shotgun. They'll drop him for a loss. The quarterback draw not successful there. Nope, and I'm going to tell you why. This defense was not fooled at all on that play. High formation here. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. Juke move, and he's going to lose yards on this one. Plenty of hang time on this one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Passing wasn't much of a problem the last time this offense had the ball as they were able to get it in for six. They'll set up shop at the 20. It's a full house backfield. Drop back to pass. Short to off. And it's caught. McAfee with a takedown. Only three yards there on the throw. Second and seven coming up here. Ball on their own 23. They'll line up in the wishbone. He's in, got away. He spins around. They'll bring him down, and he comes up with a nice run. A nice run, but they kept him from getting out of bounds and stopping the clock. First and 10, ball on the 33-yard line. They come out in the bone here. They'll throw on first down. Throws it to the outside. The ball is tipped. You got to be careful throwing in the coverage like that. Well, Coach, I don't think it was a poor decision. It was just a great reaction by the man in coverage. So it's second and 10. Ball on their own 33. They'll line up in the wishbone. He drops back. He's looking. He's going left. It's tipped. Excellent job of getting a hand in there to break up the pass. It was, Coach. That one had reception written all over it, but the defender stepped up and made the play. Third and 10. Ball on the 33. They come out in a nickel. Back to pass. Looking. Across the middle. It's deflected. He tried to force that one in there. It should have been intercepted. He can't be thrown into coverage like that. Ball on the 33-yard line. They line up to punt this one away. He gets it away. 
Number 26 fields at the 29. And now we'll see the offense come out onto the field for their next possession. They'll go to work at the 33. The Saints line up with six defensive backs. Hansen steps back to pass. Throws it to the outside. And that pass falls incomplete because it was deflected. That's great defense right there, Brad. That's something the coaches always remind their players to do. Get a hand up in the face of the quarterback. Hansen with four wide receivers. Hansen drops back to pass. Throw short. Complete. Brown. Brings him down. Four yards on that play. One man backfield. Drops back to pass. Looks. Throws this one out to the right. And he can't make the catch. Dropped by the wideout. They line up to punt this one away. Bowman back deep to return. Lobdell gets it off. Bowman fields it at the 24. I don't know if you guys saw this, but the coach gave his offense quite a speech before he sent him out there. And let's not forget, they had some things clicking the last time out. He's probably just reminding them to finish the job this time. They'll get the ball here at the 30. They go with the option. The lateral. Harvey lays it on him, and they were lucky that one didn't go for more. No question, and they were not ready for that option play. They had guys running everywhere except to the ball. Lee, you're right. They looked like they've never defended the option before. The tailback had a ton of running room there. They'll throw on first down. Rolls to the right. Throws short. Off his hands, incomplete. Davis, the intended receiver on the play. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 43-yard line. They're lining up in the 5-2. He drops back. He'll dump this one off. McFadden brings him down. He ran a good route there and was able to pick. Felt that he may have some success. Well, they had some success on that play. First and 10. This is the fifth play of this drive. The defense lines up with six DB. Back to pass. He's looking. He unloads it. And he's all the way in for the touchdown. And he hits the PAT. We still have a half left to play, but right now, they've got this thing under control. Our score, the Saints, 26. The Vikings, 7. We're ready to start the second half as the teams are lined up for the kickoff. And they'll be returning this one. Bowman fields it in the end zone. Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. They'll take over at the 22. They come out of the bone here. Fullback straight ahead. Gallagher brings him down. A four-yard pickup by the fullback. Second and six coming up here. Ball on their own 26. It's a full house backfield. Inside you. And he's hit hard. The fullback rumbles ahead for about a yard. It's third down and five to go. Ball on the 27. 
Drops back to pass. Looking, he rolls out to the right. Looks like he's gonna run. He's into the open field. How about that conversion? Let me tell you something. That defense gotta be a little discouraged after that play. No question. You can see the guys are hanging their heads a little bit going back to the huddle after giving up a big play to the quarterback. And he's tackled. This one might be coming back, folks. Let's check out the penalty. Personal foul, face mask on the defense. 15 yards from the spot of the foul. The defense lends Automatic. them a hand with that penalty. Guys, giving up penalty yards is so frustrating, isn't it? First and 10. Ball on the 44. Here's the give. Brought down. And they threw a flag on that play. Let's see what the call is. Personal foul. Face mask on the defense. 15 yards from the spot of the foul. He's Again with a carry. And now he's got room to run. And down he goes. This offense is making it look very easy. Yeah, the defense has been unable to make a play. They have a few times, but when they need to shut him down, they just can't seem to do it. It's a full house backfield. He drops back. Looks. Steps up in the pocket. Gallagher comes away with a sack. He appears to have been injured on the play. Here's the call from the referee. Dead ball. Delay of game. So the delay of game will move him back Still a few. And I'm down. pretty sure the coach isn't happy right, with his quarterback goal. right now. That brings up second and goal. Ball on the 13-yard line. <laughs> Tackled. They pick up a good six yards the there. Gain of six on the play. The defense lines up with six DB. Back to pass. He's looking. Pressure coming. And down he goes. Somebody came free there. Yeah, the linebacker shot through and nobody picked him up. He was all over him, Kirk. He wasn't letting the quarterback get anywhere. Oh, injuries turn into seizing-ending ones. Their man at tailback didn't get the job done in the first half. And I think it's safe to say that's a big reason why they're down right now as we start the third quarter. He's the workhorse on this team. And if he's having a hard time getting yardage, then it's going to be a long day for this offense. Personally, I don't think he's had enough carries. The offensive coordinator needs to get back to basics. Call more plays that put the ball in the hands of your best player. Give this kid more opportunities, and I promise you he'll break one all the way. High formation here. to the left side. And he's shoved out of bounds. The halfback gets the call and picks up five. It's third down and five to go. Ball on the 34-yard line. Hanson is back in the gun. Drops back to pass. Looking. Throws this one out to the left. His receiver has it. First and ten. Ball on the 45-yard line. There's a shift by the linebackers. Big yeah. dog, big dog. Hot. Hanson, little toss to the right. He's gobbled up in the backfield. A loss on that one as he couldn't get past those big linemen. You got that right. They sacrificed their bodies in there and stuffed him. Nickel defense. 41-yard line. 391. Here's the pitch, left side. They'll bring him down. 
This back did everything he could to get him out of that long yardage situation, but it still isn't enough for the first. So another third down upcoming for the offense. They'll line up in the power eye. Hands it off. He's hit and got away. And they make the stop. They tried to run the ball for the first down, and they didn't get it. No, sir. You saw the defense just power through their blocks and wham into them. Fourth and inches. Ball on the 45-yard line. They line up to punt this one away. He punts it away. It's a high kick. And now we'll see the offense come out onto the field for their next possession. They'll start this drive at the 20. First and 10. It's a full house backfield. A little handoff. He might have a chance. And he's taken down. A nice pickup of about eight yards. Second and two. Ball on the 28. Ball on the 28 yard line. They come out in the bone here. He drops back. Over the middle. The ball is tipped. Oh, he had the pick and he dropped it. He just couldn't find the handle. That poor kid looked like he was trying to catch a greased pig. Easy, Scooter. At least he kept the receiver from making the play. It's third down and two to go. Ball on their own 28. Back to pass. Looks. Wants to throw outside. Got his running back, McAfee, with a takedown. Makes the catch. Gain of 12 on the play. First, First and 10. 10. Ball on the 40-yard line. line. Nickel yeah. defense. Davis on the run. And he's tackled. A gain of three yards by the fullback. Three yard gain on the play. Second it's second and down seven. and seven to go. Ball, Ball on their own 43. Drops back to pass. He's looking. Throws. And it falls incomplete. He let that one go before the defense got to him, and it fell incomplete. Well, sometimes if you can safely get rid of the ball, it's your best option. The defense will try to stop this third down as they were unsuccessful the first time on this drive. He drops back. Looking. Throws it to the outside. Got him again. And they make the stop. Good yardage on that completion. The interesting thing about this play is the fact that they ran the same play two times in a row. And I'll tell you what that means. That means that the coach has seen some sort of a mismatch out there. Back to pass. Over the middle. Got it. McFadden brings him first and 10. Ball on the 32. They're lining up in the 5-2. Penalty markers down. They took too much time. Dead ball, delay of game on the offense. Five yard penalty, still first So instead down. of moving forward, they'll move a few yards back. Boy, I hate to see guys making dumb penalties like that. First, first and 15 now, ball, ball on the 37 yard line. Yard line. David, will run it again, makes a move. Lankford with a Davis takedown, a pickup of about three. Three yard gain on the play. It's second down and 12 to go. Ball on the 34. Inside handoff. They'll bring him down. A pickup of four on the play. Gain of four on the play. They line up for another third down, and they've had no problem converting their first two. Six DBs in the lineup. Drop back to pass. Let's it fly. And it's caught. They'll drop him for a loss. Davis Nothing on going on that one. No gain on the play. Fourth and eight. Ball on the 30-yard line. A punt in this situation seems a little strange to me. Hangs it up high. 
McAfee takes it at the 12. I don't know if you guys saw this, but the coach gave his offense quite a speech before he sent him out there. And let's not forget, they had some things clicking the last time out. He's probably just reminding them to finish the job this time. Set. Hut. Hut, hut, hut. Looks, rolls right. He'll dump this one off. And a good completion that time. Number nine with the reception. Nine-yard gain on the play. Ace backfield. Hands up. We'll hand it off. And he's going to lose yards on this one. The D lineman wasn't letting anyone no buy him that time. And the big fella did a heck of a job plugging up the hole where that play was supposed to go. That guy's so big, Kirk, he doesn't plug up holes. He plugs up the whole line down there. Yo. Toss. Then tackle. Baldwin brings him down, so he picked up a few on that run. Yeah, he did a nice job of using his blockers on that run. Really a nice read. They line up in a double tight set. Set. Hot. Hanson hands it off. No, play fake. Wants to throw outside. Singleton with a takedown. Way to look it in. Nice catch. Sure was. He displayed some great hands there. Now we're looking at a first down. It's first and ten, and this is the fifth play of the current drive. They line up in an eye. He can scoot. The ten. He's all the way. Touchdown. The halfback got the carry and weaved through that defense for a score. He found some daylight and took off for six. on the ground with the counter play. The blocking was great up front, and the tailback was able to get into the open field and do some special things. They come out in the bone here. Brown, back to throw. Let's it go. Complete. Brought down. And the completion nets some very little yardage. Coach, what's up with that play? I'll tell you, those defenders crashed in and got him in a hurry. No chance to get anything there. It's a full house backfield. He drops back, throws it out there, and it's caught. McAfee brings him down for a loss. They get a one-yard loss on that one. Nickel defense. Ball on the 30-yard line. Brown options out to the right. Langford brings him down. Great awareness by the quarterback to keep it and pick up the first all by himself. Let me tell you, Kirk, why that play was so successful. The defense was probably expecting a pass, and when he ran the old option, they just couldn't stop it. No question here, Coach. Excellent play call to get the ball down the field and move the chains. And the defensive tackle's looking to cause some chaos. They'll throw on first down. He steps up, and he's going to be sacked for a loss. The quarterback had nowhere to go, and he's brought down for the sack. They've got to do a better job up front with their pass protection. If they don't start picking up everybody, then this quarterback is going to be pretty sore in the morning. That's for sure. The defense lines up with six DBs. Across the middle, and that one's fallen incomplete. So another third down upcoming for the offense. This big fella in defensive tackles in the zone right now. Hut. On the ground with the tailback. Tackle. No can do on that run. That'll bring up fourth down. Boy, you're absolutely right. Those guys got in there and shut them down, and now they're all fired up. The Saints line up to punt. Hut. He gets it away. Harvey takes it to 15. The offense ready for the first play of this drive. They moved the ball extremely well on their last possession on their way to the end zone. They'll go to work at the 19. At the 19-yard line. First and 10. Hanson with four wide receivers. Throws this one out to the left. Incomplete. And he overthrew his wide receiver. I don't know too many seven-foot guys play football, so maybe he should aim lower the next time. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 19-yard line. Hanson lines up in the shotgun. Hut. 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 
Back to pass. He's going right. Great coverage, and it's intercepted. He has some room. The five, and it pays off. Touchdown. And that was about the worst thing you could ask for. Oh, that hurts. The worst thing that could happen. And now you've got to regroup and try to get back on the field for another set of downs. And he tacks on the extra point. So under three minutes to go in the fourth quarter. And the score is the Saints, 36. And the Vikings, 13. He kicks it. McAfee takes it at the eight. This one might be coming back, folks. Let's check out the penalty. Clipping on the receiving team. 15 yards from the spot of the foul. So clipping First on down. the play will send the offense backwards. You're always taught that if you can see a player's name on his jersey, All don't block him. Hey, apparently he didn't see it. And another thing he might not see is more playing time. Hanson, back to pass. Down the middle. Complete Baldwin with a takedown. About a seven-yard pickup that time on the pass. Second and three coming up. Ball on the 22-yard line. Nickel defense. Hanson set to go to the air. He tosses it short, and it's caught. Bowman brings him down. I like the defense that was called. They just didn't make the play on the ball. You're right. It wasn't necessarily bad defense. The offense just executed, and the result is the first down. Hanson drops back to pass. Number 20 with the interception. Looks like offsides. Here's the official call. Offsides on the defense. Five-yard penalty, still first They down. get the flag for jumping early. I thought he might have been drawn there, but the official didn't think so. First and five. Ball on their own 38. Power eye set. Hut! 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 Hanson sets up the play action. He's going left. Incomplete pass. And the tight end couldn't manage to stay in bounds that time. Yep, the tight end caught the ball, but not before he stepped out of bounds. Good call there by the refs. Hanson has four receivers lined up here. Drops back to pass. Throw. Complete. Got an opening. Can't wrap him up. They'll bring him down. That was a well-designed play. Yep, good execution there. Nice job of getting the first down on that pass. McAfee alone in the backfield. Hanson drops the throw. He's looking. Wants to throw outside. And it's incomplete. This incompletion is credited to the wideout. Absolutely. The quarterback executed his end of the deal. Second and 10. Ball on the 44. Hanson with four wide receivers. He drops back. Throws this one out to the right. Someone got a hand on it. That ball should have been picked off. This quarterback had too much faith in his arm that time. Well, that confidence almost led to a change of possession. His man wasn't even close to being open. Hanson drops back, steps up, looking over the middle, brought down. It's going to be fourth and inches after that long pickup on third down. Well, what a throw by the quarterback. Almost equally excellent catch by the receiver, but the defense topped them both by coming up with a stop. Six DBs in the lineup. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. Breaks one. Got an opening. And he's tackled in the open field. And that one goes for a big, big first down. You know, every time you run the ball successfully like that, that defense starts to creep up a little bit. That's when you go to the air, my friend. Over the top. They go with the option. And there's a fumble, and it's picked up by one of the linemen. He's into the open field. Are you kidding me? They recover the fumble. The man, oh man, was at a close call. Mm. <laughs> ugly. That's about as ugly as an option can look. Well, it certainly wasn't pretty, that's for sure. But like Brad said, they recovered the football. It's part of the pass now, so they just need to forget about it and focus on their next play.
They're lining up in the 5-2. Throws. It falls incomplete. He had his wide out, but he couldn't hit him. When he misses, it's usually high, and that's something he's been working very hard with his coach on. These guys can't seem to get it together and punch it in once they get to the red zone, Coach. Well, maybe this week they'll be able to find the end zone a little bit more often. Hanson off the fake. Short toss. And it's caught. And it pays off. Touchdown. They went to their big fullback, who's rarely used in the passing game, and he got them six points. This kid is a great blocker, but I think he could be a bigger threat in their passing game. I think he's capable of catching 25 balls a season. They're crowding the line. Hot, hot, hot. Nice play fake. He's going right. It's dropped. Lobdell will try to hit it just right so they can get a high bounce. Here goes nothing. So the offense takes It's second down and 12 to go. Ball on their own 23. And he'll just kneel it here. Well, that'll wrap up another chapter in NCAA Football 2006. And our final count, the Saints, 36, and the Vikings, 19. This is Brad Nessler for Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit saying so long.